Hey guys, it's Avera, and today we are back with another episode of The Witcher. We are almost at the end of chapter two, which I'm very excited about. So we have a couple of things that we have to do. Of course, like in every episode, we usually try to do a couple of things. But this one, we have to go and place the Sephiroth in the appropriate monoliths so we can continue that because a lot of these quests are still at a stop. So we have to get that done. And then, of course, that activates the Mysterious Tower quest. So those are a couple of things that we have to do today. So we're going to start getting that done. It looks like we have to place them around all of these obelisks and there are a lot around this area. So it looks like we're definitely going to be um be walking around for a couple of minutes so I'm going to try to speed that up for you guys because I don't think that you guys really want to see me uh running I think you guys know how easy it is to run in this game I don't think we need the running mechanics how are you guys enjoying the series so far are you guys um having a blast I'm really enjoying the game um honestly this is probably one of the best games that I've played like this is definitely going to a top list so it says that we have to place them okay so I also didn't realize that you could click this like the quest items never stop going you just it unlocks more for each time so the old spells still work okay so we have to go around to each of them do they keep highlighting or okay so they're just the little there's a couple of little black dots, so we have to do one for each, so we have to do ten of them, which is going to be very time-consuming. So I will speed that up for you guys in just a minute. So this obelisk, which one is this for? Okay. Okay, so Geralt says the same exact thing for each of them, so I, we don't have to listen every single time he talks. Which is fine perfectly fine so i'm going to speed this up for you guys and i'll see you guys in just a second Zephira and obelisk emerged the old spells still work Zephira and obelisk emerged the old spells still work Zephira and obelisk emerged Spells still work. Tefira and Obelisk merged. The old spells still work. Tefira and Obelisk merged. The old spells still work. Zephira and Obelisk merged. The old spell still work. Zephira and Obelisk merged. The old spell still work. All the Sephirot are set. My medallion's vibrating like mad, so the spell must be working. The tower door should be open. I can't wait to see Kolkstein's reaction. Okay, so it has appeared that we've placed all the 10 Sephiroth, and now the tower should be open, from what I'm reading, um, and from what it's telling us. So let's head over here to the tower and get this done. See what, um, what we can do in the tower, probably what boss we shall kill, and what the next step of the chapter will be. Aren't you eager to learn the truth? I'd rather stay focused. Should I get the book from the tower? Yes, hurry. We can't let Kalkstein get ahead of us. I hope that murderer swallowed the bait. I think I made sure of that. Okay, so upon entering the tower, I see a gate of water, I see a crate, let's... Okay, so we learned yet another sign. So we've learned a ton of signs in this area so far in this chapter. 
Um, I'm not sure what this one does. Provides limited mind control over weakness, weak-willed, over weak-willed individuals. Sorry, my cat's going crazy. When used in combat, the sign temporarily stuns opponents, though it may also use, also force them to help Gerald. Okay. Holy crap, that is a lot of loot. So we got the book that we needed. We have a ton of Orin, um, a couple rings, some food, just some, a swallow, diamond dust. Okay, my inventory's full. Uh, we'll get rid of that, I suppose. I don't, what are these gold rings? We'll put them on, why not? And we'll get rid of the other one. Okay. Oh, a meteorite. I think that we finally have a bunch of meteor. I think that we finally have enough meteorite um, that we would need. Alright, so we got everything here. Now let's go back outside, because I'm sure something's going to happen outside. I'm sure there's something. Kalkstein's probably going to be out here. Let's see. Yep, straight into a cutscene. Okay. You'll soon learn the truth. Good. I was getting impatient. What do we do now that we have the treasure from the tower? How do we lure the mage here? He's here already. I only see you. So you say. The detective was on to me and you trusted him, so I killed him and assumed his identity. Two birds with one stone. I needed you to open the tower. I don't need you anymore. Oh, great. We're in for a fight. Oh, this is going to be lovely. Come at your command, master. I listen and obey as a genie would. Professor, cut the crap and get him. You see, Witcher? Too much water around for Azar to feel comfortable. Fire mages, limited. He needs me to do the wet work. Good. Two worms with one stone. Tricks up or not. to pieces. Admirable fight, but duty calls us to the trade quarter. 
Contrary to popular opinion, chaos and terror do not spread on their own. The venom of Zeracanian scorpions, lethal even to mutants. Mistakes, Witcher. They can be deadly. Give my greetings to that young companion of yours. And now, have a nice time dying. All felt the battle in the swamp was the beginning of events that would soon rock Temeria. Sensing the approaching conflict, both sides were eager to test the enemy. A routine skirmish between patrols erupted into a regular battle. Led by unwavering faith, the Knights of the Order showed greater determination and emerged victorious. The Scoyatal learned that freedom could only be achieved by shedding blood, their enemies, and their own. Azar excluded me from the battle. When Triss woke me, heaps of bodies appeared before my eyes. It was the last time I was able to avoid taking sides. You're mistaken. I have him under control. And not just him. They're all leading out of my hand. I regret that Voltest is away at the summit, but I trust you'll tend to the King's Council. I assume you've resolved matters with Livarden as well. Yes. I made an offer and he accepted. He claims his superiors had similar plans, but we beat them to it. Men can do nothing but talk and then always claim the initiative. And how is your Witcher? I should be able to convince him. Don't overdo it. Geralt can be exceptionally perceptive. I know. I must get back. I'll contact you when it's all over. Never let the Witcher guess what you hide from him. Triss? Should you be up? I'd rather make sure you've recovered completely. How? Don't worry. This won't hurt a bit. Well, you seem to be at full strength. It must be that unusual Witcher's metabolism. Triss, how did I get here? Pure coincidence. I was scanning for magic anomalies and happened upon a false trail set by Kalkstein. You found me in the swamp? What happened there? I don't know. The Alchemist is still there, examining solid stone. But he won't find anything. The greater anomalies are here in Vizima. Magic anomalies in Vizima? Yes. I'd appreciate it if you could help me figure them out. But back to your health. I thought I was at full strength. You misunderstood me. Physically, nothing's wrong. It's your mind that worries me. Explain. You raved for hours. I had no choice but to read your thoughts to learn about your injuries and which poisons you took this time. I'm sure you read beyond that. I couldn't help it. Your thoughts were quite loud. In any case, I know about your recent adventures. Can you help me? Recover your memory? I doubt anyone can. But there's a small chance... A small chance of what? From what I saw, I think you would benefit by creating a stable personality. Meaning? Geralt, please, this is important. Just limit the psychobabble. You need to take a stand on the world's problems. It doesn't matter what position, just that you choose one. A strong identity may help restore your memory. Can't you just tell me what you saw? No, I don't want you turning into my vision of Geralt. I want you to decide for yourself who you are, without looking back. I shouldn't take an interest in the past? Exactly. Your memory should return in due course. We'll see. Geralt. You said something about magic anomalies. Various things can cause them, but more importantly, they can be the cause of true evil. When I last felt this way, you and a sorceress were trying to capture a genie, destroyed half a city in the process. You probably have no recollection, but a lot hung in the balance. I don't recall. I could use your help. I have some magic sensors that need to be placed around Vizima. They'll help us locate the anomaly source. All right. Give me the sensors. I'll take care of it. Always eager to please. What are friends for? Hmm. I saw a perfect wall cavity in the trade quarter near Town Hall. Place one there, a second in the temple quarter near the entrance to the sewers, and the third in Vizima's cemetery. 
we'll create a typical Radcliffe triangle. You know, of course, that triangulation is most effective in these cases. How did you get here? Long story. When you men went chasing around... Which proved effective. By some miracle, I decided to look for Salamandra using unconventional methods. Any results? Very good ones. You'll learn it all in due time. Why not now? To get this information, I had to agree not to tell you. Patience, Witcher. I'll see you later. See you. Oh, I nearly forgot. What? Luvarden, a merchant, wants to see you. He hosts banquets at the new Nerecourt. I don't like banquets. Important people will attend. I don't know. Including Princess Ada, whose curse you lifted? Apparently, she's slightly obsessed with you. I'll think about it. I'll be there. All right, I'm convinced. Maybe I can gather some information there. Six this evening. Here's the pass that makes you official in the trade quarter. A pass? Well, in addition to a quarantine, the authorities of Azima have imposed martial law. How'd I miss that? It only covers the trade quarter, which you haven't entered. So how do these passes work? Only the quarter's residents are allowed to move about. I have a house here, so I was able to get a pass. So what do I do? Well, I registered you as residing here. Falsely, of course. Who are you talking to through the mirror? You heard me? Ah, oh, sorcerer's business. Nothing important. Sounded serious. I had to make a few promises to learn about Salamandra. You could. Trust me, it was nothing important. Listen, about my identity. Progress already? I'm still analyzing. Geralt. I'll see you later. Alright you guys, so that was the end of chapter 2 and the beginning of chapter 3. Triss had saved us of course. Now we have to help Triss. We have to finish up a couple of things. Um, and she mainly talked about us needing to recover our memory, take a stance. So we do, I think, I think that we are going to be focusing more on, like, important decisions at this point, but I'm not completely sure. We have a ton of quests that we can finally get done. So it says that we can still enter the tower, but we already did that. Very confusing. So we had a ton of these quests for Chapter 2 that didn't end up getting done which is kind of disappointing because we did have a ton of these quests in chapter two and I'm not sure if we can go back, but we probably can. So we're just going to continue on and slowly start with chapter three now that chapter two is done. I mean, it's not like we're low level. We're pretty much getting going and I see that it did finish up a lot of the quests. I mean, we had a ton of quests, so it did actually finish up a lot of those quests. So that is... For the most part, almost everything is done, so I'm not worried about anything in Chapter 2, really. But we can continue into Chapter 3. Um, we have to go to the banquet with Triss. A state of emergency has been declared in Vizima, so we have to keep that in mind. Um, we have to figure out our identity, and we also have to help Triss with the newest The Source quest, which is placing magical sensors everywhere. So we are back in Vizima. Um, so at this point, that's a lot of the stuff that we have to do. Ooh, a book in our inventory is full, of course. Why wouldn't it be? So we already read that. So we'll put that back in there. We'll take that book. No. Why isn't it letting us, like, empty anything? Drop it. Okay. We'll take that. We'll read that. Okay. We have also a ton of Sephiroth, and we have these sensors now. We have a lot of things already to do, and we did read that for mages. And I don't think there's much else that... A te oh, it's a teleport. Oh, so we can go to the Swamp Tower. I think we'll stay here for now. Um, maybe we'll have to explore that soon enough. I'm not exactly sure. But we can glance around in here for a couple of minutes, see if there's anything good to loot. See if there's anything- she has a ton of shit. 
Sorry, Tris, but you do. All right, so let's... We could also empty some things in our inventory afterwards. Oh, we also have that trophy. We still do have that, too. So we'll drop that food real quick. We'll read these um, to get uh, that knowledge of things that we will know. And we could pick this stuff, the food back up. And I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, there's nothing else that we can loot. So we, I guess we'll just start exploring, doing some things for Triss. And we will just start that now that we are on chapter three.